whatever you are when your kids are not around echoes into what you are when they are around. So if you want to be a good father, if you want to be somebody who they look up to and respect and who is giving them guidance, who's building a better life for them through your own experiences and, 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 and mistakes and wisdom. And that's realistically, that's the scaffolding, that's the framework that you're, that you're providing your child with just you know, in, in day to day life then you've got to recognise that, you know, picking them up hungover or picking them up after you've been on a three-day bender, it's just, it's not a good look. And they, you know, they don't, you know, depending on what age they are, they may not know what's going on, but they know when you're not on your game. And it's just this, you know, little, it's like, you know, um, alluvial deposits going down. It's like every week, there's another layer, another layer, and then you look up and you go, hang on, that's bedrock now. And that behaviour, you know, I, I, I think you, you, you reflect a lot about your own childhood as well when, when you go through this. And a lot of the things that you experienced as a kid, I know that I experienced as a kid, and I want, used to wonder, why did you do that? You know, why were you like that? You know, particularly with my stepfather who, you know, was loved, loved his drugs and loved his alcohol and was a fucking wild man, you know, certifiable. And I used to just, uh, there was a time there I just couldn't understand why he was the way he was. And now I completely understand. I completely understand, but I don't want to be that person for my daughter. You know, I am... Um, I don't want to be, you know, I, I don't want to, I want her to live in a place, in a world where she feels protected and, and she feels, she doesn't feel anxiety, she doesn't feel threatened, she doesn't feel like, you know, think, life's full of maybes, you know, or maybe we'll go to the, you know, Luna Park this week and or maybe we'll go and do this, you know. It's like if I say something, I like to do it, you know. And it's, yeah, that's the thing about parenting. It's, it's you, can, you can default to the, the everyday and no one's going to fault you on it, you know. If you just pick them up and sit them in front of the TV or do this and that, you know. Oh, let's go and kick a footy around. You know, there's just there's levels all the time. You know, and if you stay engaged with your kid, you realise that they get more out of you, you get more out of them, and it's it it, it again you're bringing that person who you're not who you are when you they're not around to them. So it's very it's very difficult to be enthusiastic to be thinking up cool things to do with your kids if you're you know, boozing and depressed and, 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 you know, hating yourself. 